Well, for this week's Community Spotlight, news intern Kaylee Lamon shows us how Lumberjacks came together to celebrate the 28th annual Logging Days Festival near Bemidji. For the past 27 years, patrons have enjoyed taking a step back in time and experiencing activities not commonly seen in today's society. 28th annual um, Logging Days Festival, and it was started by my grandfather Leonard Dickinson, my dad Earl Dickinson, and a gentleman from Grand Rapids, Ben Ryla. The Dickinson family has worked hard over the years to keep the logging traditions up and running. I'm celebrating the days of the early 1900s using the logging methods, horses, music, pancakes, um, just everything, all lots of activities and fun for the whole family. Over the last 28 years, Logging Days has been a time-honored tradition for Buena Vista Ski Area. We look forward to this every year. Festivities include horse-drawn sleigh rides, horse-powered lodging, and another way of life. The teams of Lumberjacks help make that happen. The Logging Days heritage was designed to honor the old-time Lumberjacks. The Logging Days Festival starts off with none other than a traditional Lumberjack breakfast of flapjacks. Yeah. A lot of the Teamsters that uh, have their horses and wagons and so on will be here to come in and have some, some, something to eat and warm up. 1984 marked the construction of the Hall of Fame building, a museum dedicated to showcasing Minnesota's rich logging history. It's been a huge entertainment for a lot of people, and we really enjoy doing it. Within the Hall of Fame are tools, photos of lumberjacks, and other equipment used during the days of horse-powered logging. Today, younger generations have taken over the reins of loggers and lumberjacks to keep the logging history alive. Buena Vista Ski Area takes great pride in forming an event to honor and preserve the heritage of the lumberjacks and early lodging in Minnesota. For this week's Community Spotlight, intern Kaylee Lemoyne, Lakeland News.